Pandan MP Rafizi Ramli has been remanded for three days after he was detained just outside Parliament on Tuesday. He is being held until Friday to facilitate investigations on the wrongful dissemination of documents classified under the Official Secrets Act 1972 relating to the Armed Forces Fund Board or LTAT. Rafizi's lawyer, R. Sivarasa, maintained that it was unnecessary for his client to be held by the police while investigations were ongoing. Kalau mereka biar beliau diterus tahan di dalam lokap, itu memang bagi saya ialah satu salah guna kuasa dan juga satu macam hukuman terhadap uh, YB Rafizi dan tidak adil. Ya? He added that Rafizi was more than willing to cooperate with investigations and had done all that was asked by the police so far. No, police kata, police kata mereka nak ada siasatan lanjutan, mereka nak siasat blok dia di mana katakan ada dokumen rahsia di di apa ni di di terbitkan dan sebagainya. Bagi saya itu tak ada masalah. Polis boleh teruskan siasatan. Dia boleh siasat blok ke, dia mereka sudah rampas uh, handphone, mereka sudah rampas laptop. Itu kita tak ada masalah. Tapi kenapa tahan YB Rafizi dalam lokap? Itu kita on March 28, Rafizi revealed details from what he claimed was an excerpt of the Attorney General's report on 1MDB, proving that the government investment arm was partly to be blamed for delays in the LTAT's gratuity payments. Sivarasa said his remand period may be extended depending on the progress of the investigations.